really feel I'm trying to keep it real I'm trying to motivate You having a bad day Just cause your model won't I've been through the drama, man I've been through the playing game So yes, I feel the pain That's why I made a change So you can do the same This is for the people This is for the people This is for the people That's having bad days This is for the people That working bad It's your boy J. Michael with another V-I-D-E-O. Hit that subscribe button, the dislike button, the like button. I don't care how you feel, just keep it real, the real you nearest way. Check it out. There's some people out there that's in a relationship that's not a relationship. And y'all know what I mean, sad chicks, sad dudes. Why is y'all playing yourself cheap? Why is y'all playing yourself like a second fiddle, second bass? Why is y'all playing yourself like that? What, y'all don't have confidence in yourself that y'all can get your own man, your own woman, or maintain your own relationship? So y'all gotta play second, second best, but the person feeding y'all, oh, you know I love you, you know you first. But if they telling you you first, why is you still second? Huh? Help me understand that. If your person you creeping with telling you, I love you, you know you first. I love you more than my, my one I'm with. So if they love you more than the one they with, why they ain't left yet? Huh? They keep telling y'all the same story over and over and over again. Five years then went past. Ten years then went past. They still with their significant other, but still feeding you that oatmeal, watered down oatmeal without the sugar and the, the butter and the milk. They just giving you that plain original oatmeal spill. And you keep falling for it. You done wasted five years, ten years of your life waiting for this person that ain't gonna never be with you. Because that person is content with how things is going. They got their main woman or their main guy and still having fun on the side. Because the side piece ain't never saying nothing because they keep feeding them the watered down oatmeal. And you keep on eating it with no ingredients. They, they tell you they're going to put the ingredients in there. But you keep on eating that old plain stale oatmeal for years at home crying, feeling lonely, holding the pillow, eating bonbons, watching TV shows, texting, and they ain't texting back or they telling you stop texting because I'm with my significant other. And now you mad, you done threw your phone down, you done squished the pillow tight because you playing yourself. You plan yourself out of a life that you can have with somebody else that can truly love you and want to be with you. You plan yourself out of happiness. You plan yourself out of joy. You plan yourself out of wonderful life. You plan yourself out of, out of the experience of being held at night. You plan yourself out of getting true love. You plan yourself out of someone that can treat you like a queen. But out of someone that can treat you like a king. You plan yourself. It's time out for playing yourself like second fiddle. It's time out for playing yourself like some oatmeal, the original kind without the ingredients. Come on now. Stop 
playing yourself. Oh, I get it. I get it. Y'all them people that like being the side person because it's interesting. It's exciting. It brings that excitement, that joy, that rush until you get caught. But that's the excitement of getting caught. Then somebody get hurt. Then somebody get killed. Now somebody going to prison. Because of that excitement. Because of that rush. See what y'all have to understand. People that's playing with these side people. You can tell them all day. Oh I got a wife. I got a husband. I got all that. But when you sleep with that person, it might go good for a few months, a few weeks, a couple of years, it might be a few years. But always remember, somebody gonna come up with feelings. I don't care how much they try to mask it, somebody feelings then got involved. They try to they try to hold on and hold on long as they can. But then they crack. They bust. See, what you got to understand, people that's, that's um, playing with these side people, this is what y'all have to understand. Y'all might think it's a secret, but nothing is never a secret. Because this is what you have to understand. Like, say you got a woman and you marry. And you out with your homie, but you got this side chick. You out with your homie. Now your homie see this bad chick. And he like, ooh, dog, I'm finna get on that. You gonna go, nah, player, that's me. Your guy gonna go, oh, you married. Remember that chick I was telling you, you know, that's my side, man. Now he done told somebody because he don't want him, he don't want his homie to push up on his side. You see what I'm saying? Then he gonna go tell somebody because they might be out and be like, man, that's that's that that's old boy side. What? Now it's out there. Nothing is never a secret. Somebody always know. Always. Y'all might think they don't know, but somebody know because somebody gonna always tell their best friend somebody they feel they can they can trust and somebody they feel they can confide in. Because again, feelings got involved to where they have to share it with somebody like, man, I love this girl, man, but she won't leave her dude. Oh, I love, I love, I love this man, but he won't leave his wife. So they got to confide in somebody to get it off their chest so they don't go crazy, so they don't snap. Y'all playing yourself with these side games. Y'all listen to these rap songs. Y'all listen to these love songs like being a side or, or playing second fiddle is good. It's not. Trust what I'm telling you. It's not good playing with somebody's feelings. It's not good stringing somebody along because something gonna happen eventually. And then what you gonna do? Especially these guys out there or these women out there that's messing with the, that got a good husband at home. But y'all messing with this side dude that ain't got nothing going for him but some good sex. So you finna take a chance on leaving your good home for some good sex. And all you gotta do is role play with your husband at home or role play with your wife at home. But y'all wanna take a chance with this thug, this gangster, because he putting that wham bam slammy lamb down. So now you gonna take a chance on messing with this, this, this top figure dude with this penny dude. Now you didn't get caught. Now you sad. You crying. 
Now, now you didn't get caught. The dude she was creeping with, he don't want to be bothered with you no more because it ain't because he, he don't want to be your woman. He was cool with being the side dude because he can do it to you and go on by his way and do it to the next chicks. He didn't want to be tied down or she didn't want to be tied down because they having fun being the side chick, but it's not good. See, it, it worked both ways. The side, the side person can be playing and the person that's, that, 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 that's playing with the side can be playing. It worked both ways because when you get out that relationship, that relationship go awry. Now the side chick or the side dude like, ah, I'm cool because I don't want to be tied down. Now you hurt because you done messed up your home for this person you was playing with. You get what I'm saying? Trust and believe what I'm telling you. Even the sad dude or the sad chick that didn't want to be with you, they want somebody in their life. They just didn't want you. They was content with having sex with you and playing around, but you wasn't the one they want because they looking at you like, if you can cheat on them, what you gonna do to me? Hmm? That's how they look. It not, 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 don't get me wrong. All cases not like that. Some cases they leave they, the significant other and they, be, they become happy. And they build something. I know a few people like that, but trust what I'm telling you though. The sad chick or the sad dude, they don't want to be with you. You get what I'm saying? Y'all gotta stop playing yourself. Like second. And find love. Find that person that's gonna love you. Find that person that's gonna treat you right. Find that person that wanna be with you. Find that person that's gonna treat you like a human being, the worth you are. You are worth more than how you play in yourself. Think about it. Think about it. Look at your phone right now and be like, man, she ain't even text me, man. He ain't even text me. I've been texting them all day. They text you when they get back to you, when they feel they're ready to talk to you because they with their significant other. You second. You get what I'm saying? Stop it. It's somebody out there for you. Stop rushing into stuff. Stop listening to all the flim flam and the runny round game that people be playing or these guys be saying or these women that got these bodies and these dudes like, I want that. Stop playing yourself short. Stop playing yourself short. And know your worth. Because when you play yourself short, you saying you're not worthy. When you play yourself short, you have a doubt in yourself. When you play in yourself short, you saying you ain't able to be loved. That you gotta play second because this person telling you these whatnots. Love is wonderful. When you laying next to somebody that you truly love. You wake up with somebody that you truly love. When y'all can go around each other and have fun and kick it and have and play and crack jokes on each other like kids. That's fun. When y'all can have serious conversations about any and everything. That's fun. Because y'all are grown. Y'all are in a real relationship. Y'all just not in a relationship. Y'all are best friends. Y'all are homies. Y'all are dogs. That's what a relationship is about. Y'all go out here and mess around with the same thing you got at home. Y'all just got to make it exciting. When, when, when stuff get boring at home, it's when people start trying to wonder. When, 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 when your woman or your man start distancing themselves, but they still love you, but they distancing themselves, now you got your partner right there with their eyes open looking because they feel they not loved at home. They feel they not wanted at home. They feel you done lost interest. So your, your eyes on something else. So they think your eyes on something else, now they looking at something else. Like I told you, 
it worked both ways. You got to keep your home happy. And them sad people, y'all got to quit playing with people's homes and build your own home. And you will see your grass is just as green as the grass you're trying to cut. Do your own landscaping. Study so trying to do somebody else landscaping. And watch how beautiful your yard can be. Leave that yard alone. Because eventually that yard going to self-destruct. And you're going to be right in the middle of it. Do your own work. Find your own man. Find your own woman. What? You're not happy? You feel you got to be second? That's the only way you can be happy is being second? Because you feel you can't hold a man or a woman on your own? You only, the, the only way you can hold a man or a woman is playing second? Don't play yourself like that. Love you. Respect you. Know your worth. Find that man. Find that woman. That's for you. Because they're out there. But you can't find them because your heart is wrapped up in the person that you can't have. Come on. Think about it. Love is real. Respect your worth. Know your worth. J. Michael Wow.